I'm going to do the auto-tune setup on my DJI 550 using PixHawk. And to do so, open up your Mission Planner. And you need to get inside. At this point, you connect your quad to your USB port. Go into Config and Tuning. Hit the connect button, make sure you pick COM4, the baud rate, hit connect, there it is, okay, you've got a green flashing light, and then here on the left go to extended tuning, and right here, find out what channel you're on, I'm using Channel 7 is my return to launch. Right there. Okay. That is what I had here. But I've since come in. I've chose auto tune. Hit OK. That's going to stay there. That's going to allow me now, channel 7, instead of being return to launch it's going to be auto-tune when you perform the auto-tune you need to land the craft power everything down to allow the programmers to write and then come back here that'll that'll put the copter back in return to launch automatically but here in your software, you have to come back here again to config and tuning. Hit the drop down menu and choose RTL and put that back in there in its place after you've done the return to launch. Or I'm sorry, after you've done the auto tune. Then you put the return to launch back in there. And uh, you can do the self auto tune five six minutes and uh, make sure you have a good battery set up uh, ready for the flight but if you can see here I've got my latest I'm picking up the hex and I'm moving it by hand see that and I'm just rolling it rolling it by hand I got everything ready to go. And I've got the latest version, Hydrocopter. Make sure you download that also. But uh, you can play around with all these settings, do a whole bunch of stuff. I'll let you guys know how it goes. Now I'm using the PixHawk 3DR Robotics PixHawk.